Hello everyone, welcome to this channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you on how to create a sequential numbering or customized auto numbering in Microsoft Access without using the system auto number. By the way, this video is requested by Kadako TV asking how to make buyer, like for example 2021-001 and then followed by 002 so this is the list of number and by the following year the number will receive to one we can do this guys and also we can do this by a month if you want and by the way if you are new to this channel and wants to learn more about microsoft access then please consider subscribing this channel for more videos your subscription is highly appreciated so now let's start let's um, start from the scratch And let's go to this design view. Let's type invoice. And then let's put series number. And then next is invoice here. And description. So only this one, guys, because this is just a sample. Yes. Let's click and create a form. And then let's go to this one. Form properties. And then let us select the before insert code builder and then click ok so now let's start the coding guys this is uh, a very minimal lines dim b last or the last record as variant and then dim m next or invoice next as integer and then made that and this one guys invoice here equals format so the format is yyy stands for year okay that's it and then b last was so we we're gonna use the dmax function guys or the maximum value or the highest uh, value so our string would be the series number let us open this first this one guys series number And then the next is the criteria. Our criteria is this one, invoice here. And this one, me that, that value. Okay. So let's proceed to F function, guys. F is null the variant then invoice next equals to one this one guys what if else if else invoice next is equals to B last or the last record plus one and then NF and then for the value of 
this one the series number let's type me that series number equals invoice next that's it so let's try guys so when we type like for example okay sabon series number is one and then the invoice here is 2022 let's go to next record let's type okay series number two so what if guys um we, we want to create another file for invoice number so let us close this and then let's go to the design and let's type invoice number and also it's a short text guys we can set to uh, 10 okay so now let us open let's go to the sign view and add field so invoice number so let us replace this for invoice number and then we can hide this and then for our core code we can add here me that invoice number equals format date so let's put year started by year yyy concatenate and by the way we have to close this first okay that one and format next is the month and then concatenate the next is the series number so we'll put me that series number okay so let's try guys For the next record, I'll type here, okay, so 2022, and then we are now March, month of March, and then invoice number 003. Next record, okay, four, next record five so what if guys we want to um change the date for example um we'll change this to 2023 okay so we are now 2023 so the number guys will um, reset to 1 okay so next record when we type okay 2023 and then we are now March so the number reset to 1 so, cannot um, cannot be duplicate so let's go to invoice and then for our primary key let's choose this one okay that's it and save it cannot be saved okay uh, let's close no we will 
delete this so now let's go back we'll create this as primary key so let us continue new record okay 2023 and then march 1 and then next record 2023 um dash 3 dash 2 what if uh we'll go back to 2000 to 2022 next record okay 2022 dash 3 dash 6 let's go to the table so the last is uh, 5 so this one guys so this is um crack okay so what if we want to reset every month so all we have to do let us click event and then here format let us add the month and um, format date That's it. Let's check the previous. Okay. The last record for March 2022 is um, number 6. So when we proceed to the next month, for example, um, it has changed to April. Okay. This one will reset to one. Okay. okay. Twenty twenty two does month of four or month of April and then one. Next. So, 2, next, 3. That's it guys. I hope this video helps you a lot. And if you are new to this channel, once again, uh, please consider subscribing this channel for more informative videos. That's all. Thank you and see you to my next video.